going to be starting off on PS2 as well. This is a stage that I know neither Falco nor Juninja particularly like. I feel like it gives them like way too much space when they really want to keep it tight. Tilde with a fantastic follow day, um, just able to, you know, blip things up, make sure that nothing was going to spiral out of control, even if he does have to hit his teammate in the process. And this is actually, I feel like, really where Tilde and Daniel want to be, creating two separate 1v1 situations. Not only can they like ping pong them in between each other, these are very like consistent combo heavy characters, and they want to be able to just go off on their own. Oh my god, he just... I don't understand. He just got up and into the fully charged death smash. I guess you have to hold that, it happens. Nice recovery from Tilde actually. The up B just like sort of pressures Dr. Mario and forces him to like sit and shield because if he doesn't he might just eat the up B hit for it. And that does quite a bit of damage from what I remember. Ooh, I love the corner pressure right now from King Arc and Pink Thumb, but a really, really nice use of the reflector from Tilde just to be able to get himself back onto stage. Nice high recovery getting behind Fania. That was such a good trade in position. He saw that Venya is going to be in front of him, so he can side B and fall, and it's okay if he's stuck in a little bit of lag doing so. I like that King Arc went to go run to Pink Duck um, to go help him out, but they had like the same idea at the same time. And then as a result, they like kind of had like a moment where they didn't really get all that much off. Well, Pink Dog able to convert off of an up smash into an aerial and eventually get another up B as well. So this is really good stuff from King Oak. I love the way that he's just keeping um, Tilde off of Pink Dog because he knows that Pink Dog is so confident in his edge guards that it's best just to leave him on his own and make sure he doesn't get interrupted. Tilde! That was... Ooh. No! Oh my goodness, I saw Venya jumping in at the same exact trajectory, and then he jumped right into Tilde's folder. So unfortunate. I think this is such a doable set for Pink Dog and um, King Oak right now. King, uh, King Oak just has to find a way to hold on to the stock. Mega Man being quite heavy, it's not going to be too much trouble. But Tilde, I mean, uh, Falco and Guninch are definitely not characters that struggle with killing at all. Yeah, going through the pummel, that might have been an up throw. That would have been just about anything. This is a very, very even set right now. Ooh, King Arc throwing uh, Venia to Pink Dock, hoping that he'd be able to convert off of it. But King Pink Dock was not in the proper position to be able to punish that. King Arc trying to get an early kill with down air. Not going to fully connect. I really like that air dodge from uh, Pink Duck. Such amazing awareness just to be able to dodge his teammate's crash bomb. Nice up B out of shield, almost getting the stock, which is really surprising. And just landing an up smash on Venya. He got such a good read on the land. What a recovery from Tilde. That was that was genuinely amazing. Just shout outs, amazing props to him to be able to pull something like that off. Yeah, landing too aggressively onto um, King Oak Shield. Normally you would like space that in such a way it would be safe. Um, so you wouldn't get hit with an up out of shield. But honestly, you're at the corner. You can't cross him up as a result. And if you try to fade back, Pink Duck was just ready to be able to punish that. Um, really nice. I just like the way that King Oak and uh, Pink Dog were able to ping pong off of each other. They got some really nice conversions off of one another. Um, and I think if Tilde really didn't kill Venya early, this might have been a very different set. Uh, he just has to be a little bit careful. Well, not that he has to be careful. I think the both of them just have to be a little bit more careful how they are edgeguarding and just to make sure they're occupying 
different reads that they're occupying different spacings. Um, but yeah. And they're gonna be ba they're gonna be going to Town and City for the stage. This is a stage. I don't. I mean, I feel like Greninja can get really early kills on Town and City. Um, just like able to wait on a platform, but they pressed it early, so everything I said about Town and City is now useless. And excuse me if I stumble over a couple of words here and there. Commentating doubles uh, alone is a little bit tough. So I'm just trying to keep up with the pace of the match. Oh. But yeah, they're going to be going to Kalos. Renny is starting off really aggressively, almost getting the tech chase on the platform with the up smash, though he inputted it a little bit too early, and King Oak was just able to tech right on through it. I love the way that King Oak is using Leaf Shield in doubles. He's using it as just like a great interrupt tool, but he just basically runs into the enemy. And that kind of pressure is amazing because it forces them to shield, and it allows your other teammates to kind of get to do what they want to do. It's the amazing way to just break the pace. Oh my gosh, Vanya jumping right into Pink Duck's up smash. He has to be really careful of something like that. Um, he has to remember that that has, I mean, like all like the Mario up smashes, right? Like Peach, and Mario, and whatever. I think they get involved on it, or is it intangibility? I forget the difference sometimes. Really nice back throw, not able to take the stock because it's from across the stage, obviously. But the reverse edge guard from Tilde actually. Pink Duck. I didn't know he had his jump save. Such an amazing way to get back onto stage. That back tail is going to be able to take the stock. Now King Oak and um, Pink Duck are really, really up. This is so good for them. The Foyer is going to be finally taking Pink Duck's first stock. Um, I like the pressure from, uh, Vanny from King Oak trying to maybe force Venia to get off of stage, but Venia responded appropriately, I believe. Um, I love the way that Pink Duck and King Oak right now are able to have really good like target switches. They they in like in a moment they double focus somebody and they just have really good coordination. But now they're recovering on the same side. Pink Duck in a way almost helping out King Oak by up being him. This is gonna be the edge code on Venia. Nice up beef from Pink Duck. Oh my gosh. Tilde is just stuck in the corner. He's choosing to take this really slowly, waiting for Venia just to help him out. Ah, uh, but Pink Duck is looking for like a throw to back throw and maybe get like a pill edge guard or something like that. Venia looking to take King Oak's stock right now. Really hungry for that forward air, using the hitbox on his forward throw to knock both of them off stage at the same time. Oh my god, such a good use of the Metal Blade um, to extend the shield stun. Um, and Tilde is actually going to be missing his tech. King Oak, I just noticed that he still had three stocks. Really nice just job of being a stock tank. Taking the Metal Blade into up smash. Finally losing his first stock. Venio almost lost his last one. That was so scary. Like when you see like Venia sitting in shield, you know he's like a little bit shook right now. Um, just about anything from Dr. Mario can kill Greninja. That's gonna be a pill into back air. Let's go. <gasps> he got the slate hit of the forward air. That's so unfortunate. He had the right idea though. Oh my god. Pink Duck is just running into Venia's shield. 
I like the recovery with Mexico Matilde. Just a nice job of, you know, mixing up the way he's going to get back onto stage. Ah, uh, Pink Duck, he had the great idea sitting in shield, but he dropped it a little bit too early, trying to recover high. But Pink Duck is covering the low recovery, and King Duck does a good job of covering the high one. Like, the synergy is kind of OD right now. They're doing a, an amazing job of playing off of each other, covering different angles, covering complementary spacings. Yeah, they, you know, they're killing it. You know, it's really, it's really nice and spicy.